Ahead of tomorrow's Light the Night ceremony, a sentiment many Alabamians know to be true, that cancer truly touches everyone in one way or another. Tonight, the story of one woman who was all too familiar with cancer already and even more so now. Tonight, her own diagnosis and what she wants you to keep in mind. On a daily basis, I assist three very busy physicians. Nikki Staten spends a lot of time at the O'Neill Comprehensive Cancer Center at UAB. Okay. Her day job in administration has given her a first-hand look at the treatments this world-class facility provides. But she now sees that treatment through an entirely new light. I noticed the swelling under my left arm years ago. Okay. But like others, I ignored it. Her blood cancer diagnosis in December 2018 changed her outlook entirely. I was angry in the beginning, a little embarrassed, uh, yeah, because I didn't understand why this was happening to me. She went through a process she'd watched from afar, meetings with surgeons and doctors, and later the treatment this facility is known for. We had a lot of discussion about various treatment options, and she completed treatment, and now she's in remission. Doctors warn everyone, don't overlook what are often common symptoms. You should get to your primary care doctor uh, or a, whosoever the physician or family care physician to have uh, the symptoms evaluated. A simple blood test might actually detect or just feeling of a lymph node in the neck can confirm that there is something wrong. Now Nikki is in remission. That's an outcome sought every single day by she and her colleagues at UAB. And Nikki says they all got there together. When you have that support, it kind of eases your mind, like keep your mind off things, and it just really helps you get through it. So don't try to fight the battle alone. The efforts to fight blood cancer in Alabama are strong. And that's why tomorrow, Sherry and I invite you to join us at Light the Night. It will be held at Railroad Park. Registration opens at 5 o'clock in the evening. The walk begins at 7.